What's up, everybody? I'm Tylock, and this is Home Fun Geek. So this video shouldn't be too long. What I'm going to do right now is I'm going to open two packages that I ordered on the Funko Pop-Up Shop. Just a quick reminder, Funko Pop-Up Shop is every Wednesday at 7.30 Pacific Standard Time, and which means 9.30 Central Time, which is where I am. Um, these actually were not ordered on Wednesday. I think these were ordered on the Saturday of SDCC. Um, I will go ahead and Put out full disclosure right now, I did not get the one thing that I wanted that day, which was the Crunchberry Beast. Uh, I'm a little disappointed about not getting him. I did get Cosmic Crunch uh, two or three days before that. Uh, did not get the Crunch Beast, so I'm a I was a little upset. But uh, I did get some stuff that day from the Funko Pop-Up Shop, so uh, I'm going to go ahead and open these up and let everybody see what I got. I'll we'll just start with this box right here. See how well everything's packaged. Hopefully it's okay because this is straight from Funko. There's my receipt. Box has bubble wrap. Can't see that. It, okay, so they did box this a box. It's like a box within a box, which is cool. Because this is a longer box. I didn't know if they would do that or not with that. Uh, this box I don't need anymore. So, just open the top of this. Okay, there we go. Very good, very good, very good. This came pretty well packaged. This is the Dorbs 4 pack. I didn't get the Crunchberry Beast. So since I was gonna go ahead and buy him, I decided, and I didn't get him, I decided to go ahead and buy the Captain Crunch Dorbs four pack with, as you can see, Captain Crunch on the far left, then Jean Lafoot next to him, the Crunchberry Beast next, and then the Sea Dog, I think is what that says. Uh, yeah, Sea Dog. Okay, uh, summer 2018 convention sticker is down the bottom right hand corner. Dorbs are cool. I, I'm I'm not as big a fan of Dorbs as I am of Pops and even Vinyls, uh, but I do like the Dorbs. I have a lot of Dorbs, but uh, anything Captain Crunch I was probably going to buy regardless because the ad icon thing I really like. Uh, like I said, I do have the Cosmic Crunch, and anything they come out with at this point forward, I will try to get. I, I didn't realize they were doing... Um, I didn't realize they were doing the ad icons characters, like the serial characters, uh, on pop-up shops. So, of course, I didn't get Toucan Sam and the others that have been released. Um, Diggum Frog uh, is something that I do intend to buy. He's still available. I've seen him in lots of different places. But what's really exciting, what's most exciting for me right now is the Noid. I saw pictures of the Noid coming out. I, I have seen that he's been at a couple of Target stores. But I haven't seen him, and I haven't seen anything online about buying him. But I hope I get the Noid. I really liked the Noid when I was a kid. He was from Domino's commercials. Uh, you're supposed to the, avoid the Noid. Basically, he tried to make your pizza cold before it got to your house. Uh, or, you know, try to get the cheese attached to the top of the box. He just tried to ruin your pizza before it got to the house. Uh, if, you, if you ordered pizza from Domino's. Uh, I really liked the Noid when I was a kid. There was actually an NES game. Uh, I think it was called Yo Noid. I played that game. I rented it from Blockbuster, which also doesn't exist anymore. Uh, played that game several times. Really liked that game. I was in some shop while we were in Austin that had video games out, and uh, they had Yo Noid. They actually had Yo Noid. Uh, so that was pretty cool. I almost bought that just so I could play that game again. But anyway, when the Noid comes out, hopefully I'll get him. But for now, there's your Captain Crunch Dorbs 4-pack. That's actually really cool. That's actually really cool. I really like that a lot. So there's the first thing I got. Second thing I got, I believe this is from the exact same day. Because uh, I bought two things that day. Or I think I did. Let me take the 
see now. That's what you see in here. Just bubble wrap and then again a box within a box because Funko packs their own products a lot better than some of the other third parties do like for example Amazon uh, or Walgreens. So here's the box here. I, I don't want to give it away before I open it but you see basically uh, what size it is. And if you were paying attention on that Saturday and you saw the Funko Pop-Up Shop, you, you know what this is probably. This is a vinyl two-pack, vinyl two-pack, Fruit Brute and the Yummy Mummy. Those are General Mills cereals uh, created as alternates to like Count Chocula, Frankenberry, and Boo Berry. Um, only a couple of years ago, they remade Fruit Brute and Yummy Mummy, and they were in stores at Halloween time or in the fall time. Uh, they don't release these two every year like they do with the others. Uh, but okay, I think for like an anniversary or something, about two, maybe three years ago, they released these two. Uh, and I wish I had gotten them then. I did not. I ended up getting just Count Chocula and Frankenberry uh, that year. Uh, but I like cereal. I really like collecting cereal boxes that are unique and different. I have a video coming soon with Funkos uh, where I'm going to show you what I've bought and maybe do a taste test of the Funkos. But anyway, this is Yummy Mummy and Fruit Brute. Also add icons. You know, I believe, I would say that this goes along with the Ad Icon series. The convention sticker is in the bottom right hand corner again on that. And on the back of this, this is pretty cool, is the original like box covers for the Fruit Brute and Yummy Mummy cereal. Hopefully you can see that pretty well. Monster cereals. Every year I get Count Chocula and Frankenberry. Not necessarily Booberry, I don't really like it that much. If the box is cool enough, I'll probably get it. Um, if these release again, ever, I will buy a box of Fruit Brute and Yummy Mummy. Maybe two boxes and uh, do a taste test on a video, you know. But anyway, uh, those are the two things. That should be the last of my pop-up shop items from SDCC. Um, I have bought more since then, but this should be the last of the SDCC pop-up shop items that I bought. The Captain Crunch Dwarfs 4-pack, the Fruit Brute and Yummy Mummy vinyl 2-pack. I actually really like the vinyls, everything, all the vinyls I like. Even things that I don't really like, like I'm not a giant fan of Deadpool, uh, but the Deadpool and Cable vinyl I think looks amazing. I think it's really well uh, designed. Uh, a lot of work went into making them look cartoonish, you know. Uh, I hope everybody got what they wanted uh, from the SDC Funko Pop Shop days, the four days that they did uh, extra releases. Um, I did not get that Crunchberry, and that's going to probably haunt me for a while. I may try to find him on eBay at some point because uh, I really like that guy. But if you like my videos, if you're enjoying my videos, uh, please subscribe. I do need subscribers. I'm going to do a giveaway at 100 subscribers. Um, to see the first couple of things that were added into that giveaway box, uh, you can look back in my past videos. There is a video going over what I'm going to throw in. Um, if you like the video, if you like this video, hit the like button, the thumbs up that's right below the video. Um, hit the bell to the bottom right, I believe, for notifications. There's a little tab in the video right now. If you look in the bottom right that says subscribe, uh, if you cursor over that the subscribe option will pop up you can just subscribe to the video uh, subscribe to my channel I guess I mean uh, so this was a good time SDCC this was my first one this year I, I got pretty much everything that I wanted but a, a couple of things um, and uh, I had a good time comment below and tell me what you think do you like the ad icon stuff do you have you ever had yummy mummy or fruit brute do you like Captain Crunch or Peanut Butter Cotton Crunch, which is my absolute favorite Cotton Crunch. It's actually probably my absolute favorite cereal, period. Uh, Cotton Crunch Peanut Butter. Uh, so I'm Ty Lock. This is Homespun Geek. And I hope you have a great day.